Hey guys, it's Jess. I'm here to talk to you today about the hottest festival look, so let's get festival ready. So first you want to make sure that you conceal. It's super important when you're going to festivals to conceal your eyes, just because you want everything to be really long lasting. You're taking Instagram pics, you're hanging with your friends, you want to be looking your best, so, and not have your eyeshadow dripping <laughs> down to your cheeks. So just grab a little bit of that concealer and warm it up between your fingers and gently pat into the, your lids. Make sure that you just get good coverage and this just neutralizes everything and helps your eyeshadows to really stick. So once you got your primer on, you're gonna take um, an eyeliner pencil. I know a lot of you guys are like, eyeliner pencil for eyeshadow? Yes. Um, I love doing this because it really like sticks to your skin and you're going to a festival, so why not change it up, right? So you're just gonna take this and move it into the crease of your eye with just kind of light strokes. And just, you can keep building it to get it deeper and deeper too. And I know like you look like super crazy right now, but that's fine. Let's just embrace the crazy, right? <laughs> so then you can take your brush or you can use your fingers and just slowly start to blend out that eyeliner. And we're not looking for perfection here, we're just looking for a nice, natural look. So next, guys, I'm gonna use my Stila Eye Primer and my eyeshadow. So it comes with this free little primer along with your shadow. And I chose a really cool, like, copper tone, and you just mix it in your little plate here together and make a paste. And I like to really like build it up because it's like festival time and you want to just let the freak flag fly, right? So. So now that your eyeshadow set, like I know it's like kind of intense. If you'd like to blend it out a little bit, go for it. If you're rocking the intensity that day, do that too. It's whatever feels good for you. And then we're gonna finish off with a little bit of mascara. And I'm using their real. This stuff is legit. Like, this will get your lashes right. You can use just kind of a back and forth motion and pulling your lashes straight up. So now, after you have your eyeshadow on, you might notice you have like a little bit of fallout from the product, which is totally fine because we have our friend the Q-tip and some makeup remover. And you're just gonna clean it up a little bit to kind of finish off a nice look. So now that you guys have finished your shadow and your mascara, all you're gonna conceal, which is your BFF of life as per usual. So just warm up that product a little bit in between your fingers and get rid of any blemishes that you might have. Especially in the summer heat, sometimes you get those pop-up blemishes you just wanna get rid of because you're gonna be taking lots of pics with your friends and you just want it to last all day too and all night. So after you guys have finished your concealer, you wanna make sure you use sunscreen. You're gonna be outside in the heat all day and it's super important to take care of your skin. Um, you have to make sure that when you're using sunscreen, you're not going above this orbital bone here because if you do, you're probably gonna have burning red eyes because when you sweat, it tends to kind of get in there. So just really gently pat that and not above this area. Get on those nice high points of your face. And I'm using SPF 70 because it's gonna last a lot longer and I won't have to reapply as many times. So once you have your sunscreen padded in there, you're gonna grab some bronzer. And since I don't have a tan, I wanna look like I'm tan. <laughs> so you're just gonna gently you know, pat your largest, fluffiest brush into your bronzer palette. And I'm using Tarte today. I love their products, it's awesome. And just gently sweep it across some of the higher points of your face, kind of maybe where the sun would hit. And just build the layers. You don't wanna end up having really dark spots and really light spots. And I like to take it down into my neck a little bit just to make sure everything's matching beautifully. So once you've completed your bronzer, you're just gonna throw on a little bit of blush. I'm using the Laura Geller today. It's like a super pretty, kind of soft, almost like mauve-like color. And just take your blush brush and 
tap it out a little bit and use the apples of your cheeks so you look nice and cheery. Then smile if it helps you to find the apples of your cheeks a little easier. I just dab up my nose there. So now that you guys have made it to the last step, hooray! Uh, we're just gonna apply a little bit of lip gloss and I'm gonna use the Urban Decay Naked Lip Gloss. I love this because it's not really sticky and when you're outside in the heat, the last thing you want is sticky lip gloss, as well as you mean sticky. <laughs> so you're just gonna apply a nice light coat to keep your lips moisturized and looking beautiful. So to pull my uh, festival look together, I have this little headband I'm just gonna throw in. And I like to mine right in the front. You can put yours kind of in the back too. So this finishes off our festival look, guys. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Leave your comments below and let me know what you think. Thanks for hanging out.